Good morning, everybody. So I'm in the shed and I'm picking up my screw bag that we bought from Menards. And I, want, <laughs> I wanted to show you uh, something is collecting nuts for the winter. Check this out. And see in the bottom of that bag? Uh, <laughs> yeah. Something's collecting nuts and putting them, putting them in my bag with my um, hardware for my fence. Yeah, isn't that cool? <laughs> it's funny, too. I was like, where did all those nuts come from? Yeah, so, crazy. Uh, must be a little chipmunk or something. But, yeah, he's got all kinds of, uh, those are from the oak tree. Little oak nuts in, down in there. <laughs> pretty funny so yeah so that's what I'm doing today and uh, we're gonna get our stuff and we're gonna go over by the fence so we're gonna get started okay guys so we have our next uh, 50 foot section that we're gonna attach and this is going to be my fence right here and then we're just gonna go down I have the last um, five posts that I had so we're just gonna finish this uh, section right here today and see how it goes okay guys here's a little bit of how it's going here's my first post it's going really good um, it's nice and tight um, everything's looking pretty good the span is not too far so doing pretty good there it's flush to the ground. The only thing problem I I got right here is there's a root right there, so I need to notch it out a little bit. So I need to get my uh, my little fence cutters right here, and we're gonna notch maybe just the bottom part of that out and see how uh, better we can get that to fit closer to the ground. Because you can kind of see it's higher right here. And it goes up so maybe yeah yeah because I don't want him to dig because it's not uh, laying perfectly flush to the ground so yeah we'll see okay so instead of cutting the fence I just decided to put a screw in the bottom of that root and it'll hold it so he won't be able to uh, raise that up and it really tightened it up so that's good I didn't have to cut the fence and uh, and I just used my foot and notched out right there so that it'll lay flatter uh, over this way so it looks like um, I have this post and that post and then I'm out of post so we'll get this one um, all uh, all screwed down and uh, we'll come back and I'll show you then okay guys I got the last two uh, posts attached got the fence attached and you can see I have enough for um, another post so I'm excited about that um, but I ran out of posts <laughs> but at least this section is uh, completed it's attached and then all I have to do is uh, come back and make my fence and that's my piece for my fence right there so we're doing good let me show you down the down the way nice and straight look at that yeah it looks great don't it and I am happier and happier the more fencing we have up for these guys because um, it gets really be kind of scary when you don't you're not really sure where they're at so it's really a peace of mind for us that they're that our animals are protected as well so it looks looks really good I'm really excited about it and it's uh, nice and tight so yep looks great all right guys so thanks for watching and we got another part of the fence up, which I am completely excited about. So 
yeah the, the more we can get done and up for these guys for their safety it makes me happy and it's a win-win all right guys thanks for watching and we'll catch you on the next one